My Venture Unifor basically deals with two core technologies. First one being uh, speech recognition, which is basically the ability of a computer to uh, convert speech to text. And the second one being speech authentication, which is the ability of a computer to authenticate who is speaking. And so uh, uh, my innovation and my company have been working on this for the last eight years. We've created IP, we've created patents. Uh, we first, first started working on the Indian vernaculars because as you know, India has lots of languages and different dialects, each language, and that makes it really complex. Uh, and then, uh, as we've succeeded in doing 14 Indian vernaculars, we've now started adding other global languages, so our overall language count is over 30. Um, and so we do multiple languages, multiple dialects. So that's really what the innovation is about. One of the challenges is that the interfaces of mobile banking today, as they exist, aren't very semi-literate, illiterate friendly. Right? So a person in a village who may have access to a phone may not be a smartphone, may not be English literate. And so giving them a mobile banking app or just to tell them that put a finger on the Aadhaar device is not very involving. And so we've created an app which is all spoken. So a lady in a village could, could dial a number and say, I want to send 500 rupees to my She would be speaking to a machine, she doesn't know it. And then the machine says, yes, I'll do the transaction for you. Please authenticate your voice. So she'll say, meri awaz, meri pehchan hai. Right? So both speech to text and speech authentication. So high tech technology made to work in really low tech environments, uh, capturing all the noise, reducing the noise, making it available uh, at a village, and then connecting it to a core banking system. So as she's doing this on the phone, the system is communicating with the core banking system, actually doing the financial transaction and talking back saying aapka transaction ho gaya.